That guy followed me, Robert. I guess it doesn't update the viewer count or the um, like the the wa total watched and the followers the green, until you refresh the page. It only updates up the here. viewer Shaw. count. But when I updated the page, because I had a um, I had to re-update re it so I could get the picture back on there. I saw it, and it said I had six followers now. So I, I checked my email. Sure enough, it was him. I was like, yeah, yeah. It's always nice when they just so follow you without having to ask there, Frank. for it. Yeah, the whole idea of a lag, lag putt, sometimes you build a three or a four foot circle. Just try and get it inside that. Good putt. Yeah, that's a good par there, Rich. Stepping up to the shot. It's a shame that ninth. night dev costs yards. money and not well, it and is night bot doesn't do the, off the thing that night all these dev sort of does. Undulations and curvature on the fairway. Uh, you'd think well bunkered, but the last bunker on the, the right one, side. The, like the streamer that you see where it pops up and it says blobity blah is following you. That'll be sort of some, uh, you know, it's because they're part of night dev. The and from what I hear, night dev's free green, at first, but then they want you to pay for licensing. Very good chance, even with a wedge in hand, to get the ball close. A good way to finish the front well, line. There's this other thing called Nightbot, which watches over and it does some some free stuff for you in your um, your chat and stuff like, like that. That way you can have like after a certain amount of ch classic. chat marks, it, you can have it post yeah, like if you something so like for instance. You, if you're enjoying what you're watching, feel free to follow and that was a nice birdie and like I think no that's what um he's feeling pretty good about his position on this leaderboard. Seriously, I think that's what I think to this point. I'm pretty positive well, um Dado uses night on the front side, but Frank, we know it's an 18 hole game, isn't it? That's right. Now's not the time to pat yourself on the back. Good contact, good result. <laughs> Nicely played shot, about 310 yards down the fairway. Frank, really good chance from this position to make a birdie. Yeah. And really, the only thing he's looking at right now is the but flag. There, like you know, said, a, a there's some special. streamers that use the night bot, I mean the night dev. And what the night dev does is, like I said, when someone follows you, it literally pops up right then and there. Be part of this back nine and a good approach shot I have this I'm sure there's other things. It's that sneaky distance. Well, you're not going to make that putt all the time, but they'd like to at least get it to the hole. If he keeps putting like that, he's going to be an announcer in no time. No mistake made there with the park. There must not be many really people streaming. Hole. This is the part three um, up here at Wolf this Creek. game. Rich, remember that book? Uh, it's probably like solid when, when this you is streamed what this about, um, Far you Cry. Must hit that shot solid. Since I started streaming this, you. and remind yourself too, there's what, enough green grass. An hour or two ago, green. I've already had 14 fault. I mean, not 14 followers, 14 people pop in. Not too severe, but this is a fun par three just to look at, or even at least experience.
Pretty close. We'll be looking at about 15 feet. <clears throat> Just oh, singed, just hung up on the lip. Yeah, but at least he's burning the edges. You know you're hitting good parts. For par. Just dwindling the holes down. Pars are fine right now. From a par three to a par five. Here at the 12th, it measures 560 yards. A sweeping dog leg left, and there is some trouble down that left side. This is a scary tee shot. There's no two ways about it, Rich. Um, you've got to get the ball in play because you, you can really rack up a good score here. That water very much in play. Doesn't matter what club you decide to hit off the tee. 560 yards actually is reachable, believe it or not. But uh, you, you've got to get it on the fairway. You don't really have to be too brave and try and take too much over there. The other thing, too, to consider about is, is this green is nearly half the length of an NFL football field. It's 55 yards from the front of this green to the back of the green. Oh, it looked like he caught a flyer right there, Frank. Well, I don't know what he caught, but this is way too much. Man, after last night, it kind of gave me some worries about next right week. There. So close. What is he able to like? Shouldn't be a problem here. I was like, damn, this is a little harder than I thought it was going to be. Oh, I know that. It, it, we were, we were messing. Close to six under par for the. No, that's not what I mean at all. Thirteenth hole here at Wolf Creek, and Frank, anyone can say, "Oh, I'm gonna take this one over the trees," but very few can stand up and say, "I'm flying this baby clear over the mountains." Yeah, if you take the direct route, um, obviously it's going to be much shorter than the 350 yards that it's measured as a dogleg right. So the direct line, well, I don't want to tell you the exact yardage because it might give you too much of a clue, but it might be worth taking. It's going to be a blind tee shot, though, and you're not quite sure on the outcome. I'm just contemplating whether or not I want to try to do this or not. Frank, this really is a remarkable turn of events, considering that earlier we had pretty much written them off. Well, we had, and for good reason, too. was not playing well. Um, it looked like it, it, the round like was going to continue to go in that there direction. A lot of but somehow, a lot of risk. believe me, I don't know how, he's just but completely turned this round around. Big payoff if it works out. He's going for a little extra. Go ahead and try it. Really powering up here. And I did it. Oh, it's a darn Just shame. A I can't. I'm gonna have to make sure I highlight that. Great chance for an eagle. Frank, it's one thing to because jump start your round. This would ignite the round. Right? Yeah, you don't normally see two. Yeah, when you're in it, you can't do. So the chances of having when you're in the middle of it, you can't think game is, is DVR, so can you? In clip now. Last three minutes. In. Sorry, you can't record while broadcasting. Darn. I'll have to remember to make a highlight out of that because that was pretty badass.
you have to make those from that distance? That hurts. We'll make birdie if this drops. Well, what I, what, so what I was getting so excited about is I had a, um, I had a hole and the, I'm, I'm in Describe like, pl I'm playing like, kind of like in, I don't know where I'm even playing, but I'm like playing beautiful. somewhere where there's it a lot is, of like hills and view. mountains, like for instance, like right now I'm, I'm shooting to where, the, where I'm, the where I'm shooting is 197 feet below where I am right now. So now there, there was one where I had to shoot really high up and I had to go over, or I could either go to the left of where I was and not get as good of a hit or I could risk going into the, shooting into the mountains good strike and I just had to put a lot more power on to it the pin. well I I, Frank, I tried to over swing it and put it in or put chops, it up there good chance to make and luckily I this got lucky and just hit it perfect like and went right over the mountain and onto the green really so I, I had a sh I didn't display. make my eagle shot but I actually had a chance of getting an eagle Instead of play right there, my the second approach. shot putting it onto Another the green, good I was already on the green. These so. putts keep the round together. That was why it was so exciting. You're like, Michael, it's sports. I don't care. You can see why this player has been compared to a young Rory McIlroy. Featured golfer making birdie and now sitting comfortably inside that cut line. 140 to the flag. Which is sports, which means you don't care. This is a good looking shot. Wow, Frank, he is dialed in. Yeah, that was just some shot on that. Easy, buddy. And getting ready for the putt. It was kind of like last night when, when Phil was given his major league. Um, Liner. Even though how much you love Phil, you were like, birdie. Phil, it's sports. I don't care. <laughs> Short par four, 16th hole measures only 393 yards. But Frank, as is the case with pretty much every hole, despite the yardage, there's plenty of trouble. It does. It plays tricks on the mind's eye here. It looks like it's a dog leg going one way, then back the other way. But really, it's built as a straight hole just across the canyon. And, and that's the way you've got to play it. Um, I don't think you can drive the green, even the longest hitters at 393 yards, but uh, just a nice drive down there. Take the bunkers on, get it past there, and before you know it, you've got a little wedge in here, and it should sit up nicely for a birdie. Right out of the center of the bat. Did you hear that? It's a good spot right there. Center cup. Frank, these days golfers are training like high-level athletes from other sports. Rory McIlroy, for example, has been using a guy by the name of Steve McGregor who happened to be the trainer for the New York Knicks of the NBA. And part of his training now is high altitude. Um, the majority of the medal holders, for example, in the Olympics, uh, or medal winners in the Olympics, actually use high-altitude training. You know, you can develop more red blood cells in a shorter period of time. But, um, you know, golf, we've had so many different types of training from the athlete side. But you go back to the old days of Henry Cotton beating an old tire. VJ Singh picked up on that. Or even the rhythm of Sam Snead. He used to count in the rhythm. It was one, two, three. It was one at the top of the swing, two at impact, and three at so the follow through. All those my, things are still very computer. valid today. Because the fact that it's, it's a couple seconds, be, or it's about... 15, 10, 15 seconds behind. Like, I said it's pretty funny watching it on my computer because obviously it's like 10, 15 Excellent seconds behind. Excellent start That's a great way to begin this hole. Frank, he could make eagle right here with a So really it's pretty much like I, I got like yeah. a permanent well his reach um, too. instant <laughs> replay. Just uh, sit back and relax here. I think we're going to see perhaps a very good look at eagle coming up. Get down. Look out. It's over. The green. It's like, oh, what happened? Wow, just look at the computer. Break right there, Frank. Well, that's what everyone else here. is going to say, except him. Frank, I'm not it must saying be because the fact Destiny here, but this is draws so much 
Greens are faster. Internet you know, already, because like I said, line, I, good I'm might have a chance. My, my video for this is, I'm not saying it's perfect. Like since I put the sound on, it's it's not not as good as it was, but. Eighteenth hole, and Frank, again, a good scoring opportunity. Short par four. Yeah, if you looked at the scorecard, you'd think you could drive this green, but uh, one quick look at the trouble in front and to the right of the screen, and you realize that's probably not the prudent play. Really, something 230, 240 yards off the tee in that vicinity is going to leave you uh, just a flick wedge into this green. It is a rather narrow green, but uh, from that distance, you'd expect to hit it close. Didn't tell those moron people to get out of the way. Frank, we've seen guys like Phil Mickelson hit it off the cart path. How well, tough is this I shot? thought that well, if, if, if I had hit my ball actually, where I hit it, what it is. I'd rather hear I thought that any day. it would move the people out of the way. But it didn't move them at all, so it hit the cart path and then hit the person and completely stopped. I was kind of hoping to use the cart path to keep my ball moving. Terrific golf shot, and now that for an easy birdie. I tried to make it short for you. <laughs> Knocking down all the shots today, now at 13 under. So through one round, Frank, our leader really put on a good show today. They certainly did, Rich. It was truly a great performance, especially from tee to green. It's not easy to come out of the gates like that. Do you know what twitchshop.com is? All right, I think I'm gonna hop off now. You take care. You too. Bye bye. Well, if y'all like what you see, feel free to follow me and leave me a like. I appreciate it. See you next video.